Claire Lopez, if Russia is indeed running out of equipment and morale is incredibly low among the troops, especially the conscripts, will Putin fight on until he literally destroys the Ukraine, even if it means the decimation of his own forces? It does look like that's what's happening, Barry. Um, in numbers, in sheer numbers of men, uh, troops, uh, equipment, it would look like Russian has the overwhelming advantage. Um, and the willingness of Putin to, to use indiscriminate bombing and shelling of civilian uh, areas of cities, of, of, of residential apartment blocks, uh, seems typical. It seems of a pattern with what he did before in Grozny, Chechnya, in Aleppo, for example, uh, in, in, in Syria. Um, but he does seem to have a plan uh, to bring Ukraine back into Russia's orbit. That's what this is about. It's not about fear of NATO. It is about fear of Ukraine embracing Western nation state, individual liberty, democratic style uh, uh, ideals. And they are ideals. Ukraine has a long way to go, but Putin seems willing and he is a war criminal to use any measure of force necessary uh, to, to destroy Ukraine at this point. 